What's up, everybody? What's good? Did we all just get Takashi 6 9 by Cardi B? It kind of seems that way, doesn't it? All right, kick it. Now, before we get started, everything I'm saying is alleged. It's just uh, everything that's unfolded in the media. I have no uh, inside information or anything like that. This is just a coincidence, and I'm just pointing it out. Uh, this is, like I said, it's all alleged. Uh, everybody's innocent until proven guilty. It's just kind of a coincidence that I'm pointing out. All right, let's get into it. You're probably saying to yourself right now, Dynamite, what does being or getting Takashi 6 9 mean? All right, well, let's look at the definition here. Getting or being Takashi 6 9 Definition, an act or acts of various magnitudes of drama which cause you to pay way more than normal attention to the person slash persons until right before their music single drops. Once music single drops, drama seems to disappear magically as if it were really never there to begin with. Single performs better than anticipated. So that's what getting Takashi 6 9 means. Okay, so let's just start off, you know, what, what happened. All right, so Summer Bunny comes out. She breaks the, the news that uh, her and Offset are, are messing around, okay? Then Cardi B, she makes a video. She says it's over. Then Jade, this person that Cardi B used to have issues with, she comes out with a photo where her hair is slightly rainbowed out, okay? Because she's, whatever, dealing with Takashi. Then Cardi comes out a couple days later with her hair even more rainbowed out. And... Is that like a subliminal message that, hey, a you're about to get Takashi 6 9 Is that her saying something? You never know, okay? So uh, after that, then you've got nothing but nonstop offset apology. You know, he's doing this, he's doing that, blah, 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 blah. Um, the one thing that struck me as odd as all of this stuff is... You know, when he came on stage at Cardi B's show, it's like, you know, that's her show. She's got management. She's got security. She's got all these things around her. So somebody had to say, give that the green light. And if it wasn't her or if it wasn't her man or if she was like, you know, I don't want anything, you know, don't you don't let him near me or whatever. I'm upset with him or whatever the situation is. Why would, how could that happen? Because it wasn't like he just snuck out there, you know what I mean? Or jumped on stage or something. I mean, it was pretty elaborately planned. All those flowers, all that stuff had to be hidden, you know, or whatever. Or maybe it was brought in in the middle of the show. Who knows the situation? But anyways, you can't just go and, you know, you know stop somebody's show and then do this whole elaborate thing, have a microphone and all that. So somebody had to green light that. So that's the bizarre part. And it's her show. She probably controls everything. So somebody had to say yes. Now, that's just that's just the one thing that I find odd. It, that's the oddest part of it. OK, so then um, so that's like the wild card of this whole situation. The rest of them, I get it. Uh, and then, you know, even Offset's dad's involved. Um, and he said that uh Cardi released uh, their child's photo, and that was supposed to be the album cover of Offset's, uh, you know, uh, uh, that was supposed to be Offset's album cover image that he was going to use. So, you know, I don't know that if that's true or not. I don't know. I don't know. But anyways, so then you've still got Offset. He's Now he's making a video. He's sorry. Um, she still won't take him back. Uh, then the video drops. It does fantastic. Everybody loves it. The next day, boom, there's a photo together of them, you know, in Puerto Rico on a sea do together, and they look very happy. So, boom, you just got Takashi 6 9 Maybe. Who knows? And anyways, while they were on the jet skis, whoever, they, whoever the person was that took them out was taking the photos. Well, anyways, listen to what she says about the person that was taking the photos. What was the, do you know the jet skiing service that we went to yesterday so I could put them on blast? Um, I could find out because I think I got an email. Do you know the name? What was the do name? Do you know the name of the jet skiing nigga? Let me tell you something about the jet skiing nigga, right? 
the jet ski, what is he, the instructor, yeah. whatever the fuck he is, he was taking pictures of us in our phone, like, oh, I'm going to send you these pictures so you guys can have memory, and I'm going to delete it, and I'm like, oh, okay. So, yeah, motherfucker, so the pictures, you fucking send them to TMZ, or you send them. So, clearly, she doesn't seem happy that those photos got out. So, I don't know. You know what I mean? Are they back together? Are they not back together? Was it just they saw each other for the one night or one day or one week or whatever it was? I don't know. Is it all just a coincidence? Or was this kind of a planned thing? Did we all get Takashi 6 9 You know? Or what? Or what? Or does this keep going? Or who knows? Anyways, let me know your thoughts. Let me know your comments. Um, and, you know, is this... Obviously, I I think even if this doesn't pertain to this case in general, I think a lot of artists are gonna take that 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 play out of Takashi's playbook, where you know you want you want a lot of uh, whatever you want a lot of attention going on around you before you before something drops, because that way all eyes are on you. Everybody wants you know what I mean. There's a lot of hype, a lot of stuff going on. So, anyways. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. You know, obviously, please, you know, comment, like, subscribe, hit the bell, the whistles, all that jazz. Anyways, appreciate you watching. I uh, hope everybody's doing well. Hope your uh, holidays are good. Everybody take care. Be cool. I'm out.